Good morning, everyone. It is day two of the Drake Passage, aka the Drake Shake, because the water is very crazy today, if you can see. Um, I just got in for breakfast. I will show you what I got. I got... Whoa! The water just came up all over the window. Oh my gosh, that was insane. Maybe something else will happen. There's been a lot of water and waves. And I'm on deck two right now, so we're very close to the water. The camera doesn't even pick up how wavy it is outside. It's crazy. But anyways, here's my breakfast. I got bacon and some watermelon, strawberries, and pineapple. So I'm excited for that. And I have a beautiful view of the ocean. These drawers are so cute. I love them. It's beautiful. So I also still have my seasickness wristbands on. I don't know if they're really working or what. I haven't felt really seasick. I felt a little bit like meh, like not 100%, but never like seasick, I guess. Maybe a little bit like not really. It's kind of hard to explain, but the waves are very crazy. They're not as crazy as yesterday. Yesterday was supposed to be like the most intense day, but we have our balcony out here and you can kind of see the water. I don't know if you can really tell from this angle, but I have other video clips and stuff where you can see how um, wavy the waves are. But the thing is, is that like this camera does not do the justice. Literally no camera does the justice of how wavy it actually is and how much like motion there is. Like you would have to come on the Drake Passage to understand how crazy it is. Like for me, I guess I can think of it as the craziest a regular cruise ship would rock but like maybe a little bit more than that and just constantly because I've been on other cruises and it's rocked a lot but never this hard but like kind of similar but it would only be for a little bit of time this is just constantly and it's actually kind of fun I really like it so I've been having a great time I'm actually gonna charge this camera real quick and then I'm going to be going and doing other stuff and I'll be vlogging a lot of today too just like every other day and I'm so excited to bring you along so I just got back in the room the lighting is not the best in here I feel like because the window is open but that is okay um they have made our beds for us they folded some of the clothes the room is all nice and clean it is beautiful I just got back from a 30 minute um stretching workout and it is so nice because I love to stretch every day so it's very convenient so and it's also really nice like all the there's been two different instructors that have done it so far and both of them have been amazing it's been so much fun so the next thing on the agenda is a I think it's a required um, thing in the theater, like a required lecture on the Zodiac boats and how we get off the ship because I'm pretty sure we're stepping foot on land for the first time tomorrow, which is very exciting. I think today we might, there's like a chance we can see icebergs, I think. Don't quote me on that. I guess we'll see later in the vlog if there are icebergs. <laughs> Lunchtime. What's up? So I have a funny story about vlogs. What is it? Vlogs? So, vlogs. So we're, not we're playing sardines. Yeah. Hi. I just won the most intense game of hide and seek. I was hiding behind a curtain in one of the main lounges and no one found me. There was like this nice little ledge where I was sitting on and I was at like, I think it was the back of the ship. It was either the back or the front. I think it was, it was the back and no one found me. I had to come out of my spot because literally no one found me. There's a lot of places to hide on the ship. There's some pretty good ones, honestly. Um, so that was a lot of fun. I just came back to the room to check the navigator thingy, Bob, so I can see what is what the activities are going to be next. Um, there's nothing I'm really gonna do for the next, I think, like 40 minutes, so I might just hang out in one of the lounges, um, maybe try to find something to eat. I don't really know. But I ended up finding them because I came out of my hiding spot and I found them and I was the last one. So that was pretty great. Anyways, you guys, we're going to just continue on with this vlog and I'll see you wherever I am next. This one is Ria's. Yes, ma'am. We're all making Mickey Mouse ornaments. They're gorgeous and beautiful. I just 
got my water bottle refilled and we are waiting for the I Survived the Drake Passage party, which is gonna be in about 20 minutes. We're not even through the whole Drake Passage yet, but we're still having a party to celebrate it. Um, we might see like icebergs and stuff tonight and we're go we are going to step foot on land tomorrow for the first time, which is very exciting. So we'll just stay tuned for that, obviously. And yeah, I'll probably vlog some of the party. Like right there. We can see our first piece of land. It's like yeah. right there. First piece of land that we've seen in two days in Antarctica. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. So we have seen the first piece of land. We're gonna go out on our balcony and I will show you the land. In Antarctica, it's amazing. It's beautiful. Oh my gosh, it's windy. This is hard to open. Oh my god. I'm gonna like fly up. Oh, there we go. Ah, right over there. If it'll adjust. Right there, I think. Somewhere. I don't know. Let's see. Over there, right? Wait. There it is. There's some land in Antarctica. We've officially seen Antarctica. Like, I know it's just rocks. But it's amazing, like, oh my gosh. I can't believe we're finally seeing land. We have not seen land in like two days. This is amazing. And there's still some birds flying around. I don't know if you can really see them. But there is some land. There's more coming up over that way. I think, I don't know if you can really see it yet because it's a little bit foggy. But this is amazing. <laughs> Yeah, so we're gonna go upstairs. We're gonna go to the front of the ship to see all of the land and stuff, which is really exciting. First time seeing land in two whole days. I know, it's Crazy. been so long. It's our first view of Antarctica, you know. We've like actually seen Antarctica. This has now. been like a year in the making. I know. Oh, we're in the restaurant. Yes, we are in oh, the no, restaurant. We're coming for breakfast tomorrow. <gasps> we are coming here for breakfast tomorrow. Go to this, this side. That has the door. Whoa. Oh my god, that's snow. It's, it's snowing? No, not snowing, but it's on the... Oh, snow is on it. Oh, it's warm up here. Okay. Oh yeah, it is warm. Oh Maybe we'll start seeing animals, like whales and stuff. We can finally see that, it's amazing. It 
for today's vlog. It was amazing seeing land. I can see land outside of my window right now. It's amazing. Um, and tomorrow morning we are stepping on land at 8, 10 a.m. There are four different groups that get off at different times and we are the second earliest group. The first group gets off at 8. We get off at 8, 10, which is so, so, so exciting. So I set my alarm for 7 because I should be able to get ready in an, about an hour, especially with breakfast because I haven't I don't eat too much for breakfast or anything. So but I'm super excited for tomorrow. Also, just a little update. I found my water bottle. So here it is. I think I told you guys that I lost it earlier. I had it, it was lost for about half the day. But when I went to dinner, they brought it to the table and we were all cheering because I missed this water bottle so much. And I love it. And this is like my water bottle and like I cherish it with all my heart. So I am so happy I found it because like I need this on this voyage like I, I just need water like constantly I like taking little bits of water at a time anyways that is it for today's vlog stay tuned for tomorrow where we are technically putting our first foot on land in Antarctica it's not like the big it's like an island off of Antarctica but it's still Antarctica so it'll technically be like our first steps on Antarctica but it's not like the mainland I think we get to step on mainland later but I don't know it's very confusing I've been hearing different things but anyways today was so much fun and I cannot wait for tomorrow I'll see you guys in the next video make sure to like comment and subscribe bye everyone mm -hmm.